uh, Jeff Wilson Jr., who was running back 75 last year, 79 rush attempts, 294 yards, two touchdowns, seven receptions, eight targets, 31 yards, zero touchdowns on in the air. Thoughts on Jeff Wilson Jr.? I was super high on Jeff Wilson Jr. last year. I think we're going to see that one-two punch. I think Wilson right now is the – uh, the de facto number two because he's the most familiar with this offense. So obviously stay tuned to the situation in San Francisco as preseason plays out and OTAs and all this, or excuse me, in training camp um, to kind of see how they're thinking about depth chart and what these beat writers say, because right now, I mean, he's, he's the secondary Niners running back that I might take a gamble on late only because of his familiarity with what's going on. It, he was disappointing because he was coming off that year in 2020 where, you know, he had the 600 yards and seven touchdowns in, in 12 games. And I mean, he was, you know, a touchdown every other game and, and then some. So, you know, that, that's that's the kind of production you would like to see. He's uh, he's coming off the board at, uh, you know, north of running, uh, running back 100. Like he's not even on the ADP list right now because they only go up to 350 players. And he's beyond that. So it's pretty fair to say Jeff Wilson Jr. is going to be undrafted. And you'll have your your pick of uh, him off the waiver wire. And that's what it'll be is, you know, just pay attention to when, you know, some San Francisco running backs go down. And hopefully, you know, he's not one of them. Uh, and you're able to pick him up as a waiver wire. Right. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be out on uh, Jeff Wilson from a drafting standpoint. But I, I do think that he does hold some value in how they're going to utilize him in this offense. Um, and that's worth a keep an eye on the watch list and uh, see how they utilize him the you know, first couple of weeks out and see if he's worth a waiver wire ad there.